Hey everyone, and here we have a kind of important question. And the question here is: Find three consecutive odd number whose sum is one sixty-five. So, what we mean by consecutive odd numbers, or in general, what are consecutive numbers? Consecutive numbers are those numbers which comes one after the other, like the very next number. For example, if I start from four. the consecutive numbers will be 5 6 7 8 so on like that so immediate next number so they will be called consecutive i cannot skip a numbers like it cannot be like 1 and then 3 4 5 so you can see that 2 is missing here then they cannot be consecutive so they has to be one after the other now what they're saying here is find three consecutive odd numbers whose sum is 165 so when we are adding a three consecutive odd numbers for example example let us take 21 22 and then not 22 23 and 25 so if i like 20, 21 23 25 are three consecutive odd numbers right like that we have to find out three consecutive odd numbers such that when we add them the sum is equal to 165 so what are these three numbers so they could be anything so we have to find out that So what we're gonna do? This is unknown, right? These are unknown numbers to us. So we're gonna assume a variable x. You can take any other variable. So here I'm gonna take the variable x. So let us start this. So here's a solution. So let first odd number. Okay, it could be anything. First odd number b x. Now suppose first number is x. What will be the second consecutive odd number to this x? How much we should add to get next odd number? So to get that, let me take a small example. Suppose I have a one, and the next odd number is three, and the next odd number is five, right? So one, three, and five. You can take anything. This concept is applicable for any odd number you take. So here I've assumed that suppose the first number is x. So from one, how much I should add to get three? So it is plus. So if I add a two to the first number, I'll get second odd number like that. Suppose my first number is x. To this, I have to add more two. That is plus two. I'll get x plus two. Okay. Now what about the third number? So from three, how much I should add more to get five? So it is again plus two. I have to add more two. So again from second odd number. to i have to add more 2 to get third consecutive odd number so this will become x plus 2 that was my second number and again third will be again plus 2 okay this was my second number and i have added more 2 to it so this will become x plus 4 so you can see the first odd number will be x second will be x plus 2 and third will be x plus 4 so in place of x we can get anything suppose in place of x i got uh, let me take um, 17 okay then 17 plus 2 will be 19 the 19 or x plus 4 17 plus 4 will be nothing but 21 so you can see that 17 19 and 21 are consecutive odd number so in place of x we can get anything so we understood what will be the three consecutive numbers we going to assume here it's x x plus 2 and x plus 4 so let's start this so second odd number or second consecutive number will be x plus 2 similarly third will be x plus 4 now we got all the three consecutive odd numbers now what they have given when we add them when we sum them so means the addition when we add all the three we get 165 so here we're going to form a linear equation so first odd number is x plus second consecutive odd number is x plus 2 then plus third is x plus 4 when we add all this together we get 165 Now let's add the variable. So x plus x plus x will be three x, and then two plus four is six. So we'll get three x plus six is equal to one sixty five. Now transpose the six to the other side. So we'll get three x is equal to one sixty five minus six. So three x is equal to one fifty nine. Now this three is in multiplication with x. When you transpose this to other side, it comes in division. So from here, x will be equal to one fifty nine divided by 
3. Cancel the numbers. We can cancel this in 3 table. 3 1s are 3. Here 3 5s are 15 and then 3 3s are 9. So therefore we got x is equal to 53. That means the first odd number, first odd number here is 53. If we got x is equal to 53, what will be second odd number, second consecutive odd number? That is x plus 2, right? So 53 plus 2, which is nothing but 55. Now third will be 53 plus 4, which is 57. So three consecutive odd numbers are 53, 55 and 57. When you add them up, we'll get the answer 165. I hope this question is clear. In case you have a further questions or doubts, you can drop a comment below. Thank you so much for watching.